Welcome to Hitman Boxing, and I'm back with some more news. So Julio Cesar Chavez has some choice words for Saul Canelo Alvarez via his Twitter account, uh, in which he posted the following. A, G, 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 you are great as a person and fighter. Do not wait for coward, amigo, September, hashtag Mexican style, hashtag Mexican day. Uh, then he also had the following to say. If I don't make 168 for the fight with Glovkin, I will give him my pay for the fight. Julio Cesar Chavez needs to stay in his fucking lane. Because last time I checked, this fight between Triple G and Canelo Alvarez don't got shit to do with him. Because Chavez Jr. got his own shit to deal with. Because last time I fucking checked, you have problems making weight. As a matter of fact, you had a fight, or you were supposed to fight, um, Badu Jack. But you got a, some sort of injury, some sort of heel injury, right? That's fucking bullshit. It's obvious, it's so fucking obvious that you couldn't make the fucking weight to fight Badu Jack. And as a matter of fact, I picked Badu Jack to beat your ass anyway. But that's beside the point. We're getting into what Chavez Jr. was saying about Canelo. Yeah, he called Canelo a coward, obviously because Canelo is refusing to fight Triple G at the weight of 160 pounds. A fight that all of us are really waiting to see. I want to see that shit. I don't, to be honest with you, I don't give a fuck what weight it's at, but... I feel like it should be at 160 because that's the middleweight fucking limit, man. But he wants to drain Triple G down to 155 pounds. I mean, that's my fucking opinion. You have your opinion. I have mine. I don't give a fuck, really. So um, Chavez Jr. had all this shit to say about Canelo. Um, honestly, Chavez can't make 168 anymore. Uh, his last fight with Marcos Reyes, it was at a catch weight of 170 pounds. And on the day of the fight, you refused to fucking weigh in. But I tell you what you look like in the fucking ring, you look like a fucking cruiserweight. You damn near look like you were pushing heavyweight, my friend. You look like you was about 210 pounds. Did you look fucking huge compared to Marcos Reyes? That shit was fucking embarrassing, dude. And you want to fight for a title? For what, man? You ain't even earned that shit. The only reason why Chavez Jr. is relevant is because of his father. His father was a great boxer, but his son, Jr., ain't shit, man. He has zero discipline, and it pisses me off because he has all the fucking talent, all the fucking talent in the world to become a great fighter. He has, he has his father in his fucking corner who was a great fighter, someone he could take fucking pointers from, but he chooses to be this lazy fat sloppy motherfucker who likes to eat donuts and burgers while he's fucking training for his fights so he can come in at 200 pounds and steamroll motherfuckers that's what he likes to do so no i don't got no respect for chavez jr again he needs to stay in this fucking lane why are you even speaking on this triple g canelo shit you know what i'm saying and you got your own shit to deal with when if, when is your next fight dog you want to fight triple g at 168 bad fucking move one you're not going to be able to make 168. So if you put that shit in the contract about losing your purse to Triple G, that's going to happen. So two, don't put that shit in the fucking contract. And three, yeah, I added a three to it. Don't fight him because you're going to get your ass fucking whooped. It don't matter. You know, Fafara must have beat this motherfucker up so bad. Now, we all know he left in an ambulance. But I mean, damn, his brain must be fucked up, man, because he's not thinking straight. His career is down the toilet. He's never going to be like his father. But yeah, that's all I got to say, man. I just wanted to make my comments on this this Chavez Jr. and fucking Canelo shit. Keep your fucking mouth shut, man. This shit don't concern you. So let me know what y'all think. Am I going in too much on this guy, the Chavez Jr., man? Because he's a piece of shit in my opinion. Um, let me know what you think about this, these developing news articles I keep seeing. Hitman Boxing and I'm out.